Okay. So, uh, I guess this should be a quick game. Um, this is Enelin, the game I picked up on sale a couple months ago. Anyways, it's basically, like you'll see, but it's basically like a platformer Pac-Man. <laughs> not like the actual Pac-Man, not Pac-Man platformers. Yeah, you can see the demo right here. You collect all the coins, and you're chased by snakes. And anyways, uh, probably a relatively quick playthrough. Let's see. I've, I've beaten this before. I've, I've played through random mode every so often. It's been a while since I've played through the actual main campaign, I guess. Some cheats. Uh, the only one I have on is voice clips. I've, I've not actually played with this on, so... Yeah, that'll be it. That'll be... The only thing I'm using. Uh, is it an options? Yeah, options. So you, you can change your color. You unlock a bunch of stuff. I've not done a whole lot. That also, I think that also all counts in the um, uh, random mode. Anyways, there's also a bunch of video options. You can even set this in four by three, but it still has a bezel. There, there is an option to get rid of it, but I'm going to leave it on because that's how I play. And it looks good. It really looks like a an arcade game. I like the, all the detail they put in this. All right, so I'm going to start the campaign. Uh, I have a feeling this is going to be about an hour-ish. I don't know. I'm probably going to split the video halfway. We'll see how I feel at the end after I'm done. See what kind of file size I'm looking at. All right, so let's get started. We got an intro, and then we're just thrown into the gameplay. I don't remember offhand how many levels there are. I think there's 12 in a boss fight. And I'll talk more about that once we get into the game. Just very quickly showing you most of the mechanics. So the snakes can go in through the doors, you cannot. The snakes go across those, um, like shadow platforms or whatever, you do not. Uh, 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 ah. <laughs> and similar to Pac-Man, you pick up the, the big gem. Oh. And a voice clip. You do have to get all the red gems too. <laughs> yeah, you can jump up through those platforms there. You cannot drop through. Okay, so I mentioned there was a boss. Uh, I will probably be dying to it a lot. <laughs> um, this game has limited lives, but unlimited continues. Whenever you, as far as I know, it's unlimited. Whenever you lose all your lives and you get a game over, you can just restart and it costs you half your score. So regardless, I am going to be finishing this game. I just won't have a very good score. I like the voice clips. So I believe we get three levels in, I guess, a theme, and then it changes themes. Ah. Oh, that really looked like I got that that red gem. Oh well. And any stick that comes in after you pick up a gem, the red gems, is not going to be blue. 
I'm, I'm fairly certain that's how Pac-Man works, but it's been a while since I played Pac-Man. Oh, that's close. And we get a little cutscene between areas. And I believe it was an option. Maybe I skipped over that. It was an option to give the snakes hats. It, it does nothing but gives them hats. Except for one of them doesn't get a hat, and he's sad about it. I don't know that I'm going to have a whole lot... Wow, that was close. I don't know that I'm going to have a whole lot to say while I play this. Just kind of, spur of the moment, felt like recording this. Or, I felt like playing it, and decided to record it as well. like the bacon. The red one is quite aggressive. audio doesn't end up being too loud. I played around with it a bit before I put these settings. So I don't really know what how much commentary I'm going to have on this. I hope it's fine. faster than you are, and nothing I could really do about that. <laughs> Just play better, I guess. first game over here. I think this is the first time I got one and the first time I played this too. This is just a lot to manage. D did he stop and not drop down? I didn't know they could do that. Whew. I don't know how I didn't get hit there. also introducing the new mechanic here. These landmines, which do not affect the snakes. Yes, 
I don't think these conveyors affect the snakes either. Oh, uh, apparently they do. Because the faster wins. Make them go faster. Or the... That, that was my fault, I should have jumped. Well, here you can see how a game over works. School will be halved. So yeah, I, I am going to finish this game, just not going to have a very good score. That's not a good jump. Oh, oh. <laughs> okay, that, that was close. Ah. Trying to get that ruby, because I knew that was going to happen. And that's all that's left. That's unfortunate. I kept failing that jump to get up there. Almost overshot him. Ah. I, now I'm just playing poorly. I don't know what kind of rules snakes follow for like, the doors. Do they have to go into the doors and they come to them? But probably not. Shiny. Oh, that wasn't too bad. There are no big snakes. <laughs> oh, ice physics. And wind. Looking where I needed to go, not where I was at. You're mine now. Just what I need. Shiny. An ongoing theme the first time I played this, I kept dying when I had just a few coins left to get. Okay, sure. Of course it ends right then. Come up on my second game over here in a second. Just what I needed. And the rubies start whoa, rubies start last lasting less and less. Or shorter and shorter. However, uh, I expected him to fall sooner. There's gonna be a lot of game overs. You also get a ton of points after the boss. So that's why there's such a disparity between my high score and my current score. Although I'm fairly certain I got just as many, if not more, game overs my first time through. 
How did I not get that, Jim? Whatever game. Okay. Oh, I don't know why I thought he was going to fall all the way through. Snakes don't do that. What's that bird? Gyms last less and less time the longer the game goes on. I don't I don't know why. That's upsetting. I had so few left <laughs> when I died. Yeah, he doesn't get a hat for some reason. across them once. They do not reappear. Some of them leave... I did not... I... Okay. Some of them leave leap pits behind underneath them. And some of them leave platforms for the sink to go across. I think the duration of the crystals might have to do with whatever... I don't know what to call it. Act? One coin left. This is what I was talking about before. I always die when I have so few left to get. Is what, what was I saying? No, I think the duration of the crystals has, some, has to do with whatever act I am in the current... Pal set? Zone? I don't know. With respect to lasting a fair amount of time. doing. Another death that's my fault. I say that, but this game is pretty fair. Most of the deaths are my fault. I'm either just not playing well or not paying attention. So I guess I should say all of the deaths are my fault. Ooh. That was close. This might be the last zone. I could be wrong. Yeah, this is the third act or whatever, and the gym's not lasting very long. So I think that might be the case. They're just, just dependent on whatever act you are on. I have a feeling the developer is Canadian. If I were smarter, I would look up that up before I played, but... I'm not, so I didn't. Probably a safe bet with the... Ah! <laughs> See there, <laughs> the red one was catching up to me. <laughs> Whew, okay.
Yeah, I think this is the boss now. I'm going to die quite a few times on the boss. I love the intermissions. <laughs> Let's get digging, eh? Okay. So as this fight goes on, I'll get more and more of those blue coins to make the um, pickaxe appear. And then I have to hit him. And he gets... Harder and harder patterns. It's a pretty fun boss fight, all things considered. Uh, I'm just pretty bad at it. I think I went through like two or three game overs. Really? Okay. I, I feel like that shouldn't have hit me. Where's my pickaxe? I haven't tried, but I think one of the cheats uh, makes this boss in every level. Again, I haven't tried it, and it, it it sounds pretty rough, so I don't feel like trying it for a while. what Pac-Man needed, right? Boss fights? <laughs> I do not remember offhand how many hits it takes, either. But I'm fairly certain this is not the last phase. Oh, I can hit, I can hit them. Yeah, not the last phase. I did not know I could hit them. Or probably I knew and forgot. Because I haven't played through the campaign in a while. And he does not appear in any of <sighs> I was going to make it under him. Yeah, that was my fault. I should not have got myself into a corner. Okay. So I gotta survive him going through this until he gets himself on the ground like he did at the end. Okay. Of course I died. I got a game over when he had one hit left. But that's, I, I still think that's fewer deaths than I had my first time. And a one-up, sure. that too. I don't I don't know why. I think it's I think you get a bonus after this cutscene. Or the credits, I mean. Yeah, pretty fun little game. There's quite a little quite a lot of replayability in the endless mode. I don't I don't plan to show that off. It's literally just the levels I went through minus the boss. And there, there's three um like, kind of messed up glitchy worlds. Glip levels, I should say. 
it just goes through it, it goes through the levels randomly, and in between every, every three is a, uh, a stage where you ride a minecart to get big bonuses and all that. But it's it's a one continue. Once you run into lives, it's over. I do not know what my highest is. Uh, in the twenties or thirties, maybe. The snakes just keep getting faster and faster make that harder. I don't know if I checked if this developer has any more games. Okay. Oh. So I guess it was the um, lives bonuses I was thinking of. That actually beat my high score. So yeah, I, w I lost quite a bit from those game overs and I still got a bunch at the end. Yeah, that was Anna Lynn, a fun little arcade style game. It's pretty fun. Uh, I don't know offhand how much it is full price, but it's not a lot. It's and I think it's worth it. Let's see. Um. Yeah, the boss will be in every round, and you can't hurt him. I have not tried hard mode. I don't think I've tried strange mode. And I don't think I've tried 2016 mode. I haven't done any of the other cheats either. Anyways. Uh, nope, that's not what I want. Options. Yeah, bunch of pallets. I'm missing a lot of them. Yeah, that gobbled mess is one. Is the uh, I don't know what level that is. The uh, random modes. Huh? How do you how do you get it then? If you, it, if it doesn't count in random mode, because I thought that only appeared in random mode. Whatever. Anyways. Anyway, okay, so that's it. That was Anna Lynn. I hope you enjoyed this. I just uh, like this is just like a fun little. Aside, I guess this was not my intended uh, let's play, but I felt like playing it. Like I said at the start, I felt like playing this and just decided to record it while I did it. So, I hope you enjoyed. I hope you stick around for the next game, and thanks for watching. <laughs>